it's trim and tone time. Today we're going to work our arms, chest, and shoulders so we get a well-proportioned body, a more tapered look so it narrows down to a small waist. So let's begin our upper body workout. Take it down and up. This is using our thigh muscles and the anterior deltoid. Down and up. Keep your back straight. Keep your tummy in. And think about using those arm muscles. That's it. We'll have ultra sexy arms. Yes. You all want to get nice firm arms. No more underarm swabs. No more underarm sag. We're going to be doing all those exercises just to target tone the arms, chest, and shoulders. Great. Down and up. Down and up. Right now, we're really using the thigh muscles, too, making your workout more effective. That's right. Time management here. That's why we work with weights, too. Strength training really helps to well-define those muscles. Two more. One, two, can you hold it there? Slowly, negative work here, bring it down, slowly. Beautiful, the other side. Ready, out and in, out and in. Now we're working the medial deltoid. That's right, for those shoulders. We won't need shoulder pads anymore. We'll make our own through muscles. Well-defined muscles, that's it, good. Chiseled arms, up and down. We are in Alcapulco today. Beautiful city. That's it. Two more. One. Two. Hold it there. Good. And release. Okay, let's work those triceps. Ready? And press. Pull. Press. That's it. Let's use the legs, too. Down. Up. Down. Good. Feel as though you're sitting back. That's it. Press. Up. Press. Good. Really use it. That's it. Great. Relax your fingers and your hands now. Beautiful. Press it down. Notice I'm sitting back. Very important. This helps tone the buttock muscles. So we all get a nice rear view. That's it. Last one. Hold it up. Isometric hold. Hold it. Now little pulses up and down. Up and down. Good. Lift and low. Target tone those arms. Yes. We got two more. One. Two. Hold it up there. Hold it. Beautiful. Now the chest. Ready? Keep your back straight. Legs apart. Ready and out together. Out. Pull. That's it. Initiate this movement right through the chest muscle, our pectoral. That's it. Press. Down. Good. Come on. Really feel it. Pull it in. Press it out. Pull. Press. You got it. Beautiful. This will help improve your posture. That's why we're doing this one. That's right. And did you know that posture tells a lot about somebody? Body language. Good body confidence. That's it. Good posture is very important. Keep your tummy in right now. <laughs> okay, come on, we got two more. One. Two. Good. Now hold it out. Bring it down. Ready? Upright rows. Lift and down. Down and up. Down and up. Now we're working the opposing muscle group. This is the upper back. That's right, our rhomboid. That's the name of the muscle. A little anatomy eating lesson right here. Good. Come on, pull it up. Pull it. Come on. Give it all you got. You'll have a nice upper back. No more bra overhang. That's it. Lift and lower. Up and down. down, up, and down. We got two more. Last one. Hold it, hold it, slow, slow. Great. Overhead presses. Ready, and down, lift, down, lift. Relax your fingers now. No white knuckles. Up, and pull. That's 
it. Good. This is for the whole upper back. Pull it down. Good. Pull it. That's it. For the trapezius muscle group. The upper back, too. Come on. You can do it. Give yourself a well-proportioned body. That's it. Having a nice upper back is something sexy. Yes. You can wear those backless dresses, those halter tops. Two more. One. Two. Relax it. Now just relax. I want you to work the upper back. What we're going to do is drop down a little. Notice what I'm doing. Almost put your hand like you're holding a giant beach ball. Ready, lift, lower. Up and down. Lift, lower. Can you feel that in the upper back? Good. Squeeze your shoulder blades together at the top. Squeeze. That's it. I really want you to lift them higher. That's it. Today I'm using five pound weights in each hand. And that's a workout. You're welcome to use one up to five pounds in each hand. We got two more. One. Two. Good. Now isometric hold. We hold it up there. Come on, strong arms. And release. Okay, take it back and down. Back and down. Back and down. That's it. Good. Press and down. We're now working on the bicep muscle group. That's right. The biceps are very important to keep strong. They make your arm look really sleek. That's right. Take it down. We got one more set. Come on, use your biceps. Last one. Okay. Place your weights down. I've got this little rack right here. So I can place my weights. Take a deep breath. Inhale. Let's begin our cool down and exhale. And stretch your arm, your triceps up. And give yourself a pat on the back for doing so well with me today. Proud of you. Bring that arm across the chest. That's it. This is an excellent stretch for the upper back. Do you ever get shoulder tension? Do this stretch. And switch to the other arm. Up. Give yourself another pat on the back. You deserve it. I'm proud of you. Is an Acapulco beautiful? And again, stretch it across the body. That's wonderful. Hold the stretch. Stomach in. Great. Hold it. Beautiful. Take a deep breath. Inhale. And exhale. Again, inhale up. And exhale. And let's stretch the body. Lunge down. That's it. Lunge. We're stretching our legs now, our inner thighs. Oh, feels so good. Make sure while you're doing the stretch that the front knee stays in a 90 degree angle. Knee over the ankle, very important. That's it. You want to know why? To protect your kneecap and make the muscle your thighs do your work. That's why we do it. Reasons for everything I do. Keep your back straight. That's it, can you do it with no arms? Arms up. Beautiful. Release. And to the other side. Switch legs. Take it down. Stomach in. Getting a good stretch in your inner thigh. Inhale up. And exhale down. Good. Hold the stretch. Go a little lower. Come on, feel it. Great. Bring both knees together. Roll up one vertebrae at a time. Take one deep breath, inhale, and exhale. One more, come on, give it all you got. Inhale, and exhale. And give yourself a big hand, you did great today. Keep going, I'll be right back.